No other event had a greater impact on Alma's life than the three days he spent racked with torment after being rebuked by an angel. He recounted this experience at least three times, of which Alma chapter 36 stands out as the most gripping and illustrative. Part of what makes that account of his conversion so stunning is its chiastic structure. While maintaining its poetic integrity, Alma's chiasmus weaves in and out of both his public and private struggles, cradling in its center Alma's testimony of the atonement of Jesus Christ. Using the natural ability of chiasmus to accent a passage's central point, Alma beautifully emphasized the atonement as the ultimate source of his relief from torment, teaching readers where they can turn for their own spiritual relief. And now you know why.